Aeroflot Nord Flight 821 is moments from touching down in Perm, a city in central Russia. There are 82 passengers on board the Boeing 737. 43-year-old First Officer Rustem Alaberdin is the pilot flying tonight. The captain, Rodion Medvedev, 34, is monitoring the instruments and radio communications. They are making the two-hour journey from Moscow to Perm and will then return to the Russian capital. It will descend to 2,000 feet. Surface wind 050 degrees out, 10 knots. Tailwind is 9 knots. Increase your speed. Right, of course. 8 9 one 8 two, one Confirming base turn and descending to 2,000 feet. The crew prepares for landing. Flaps 30. Set. But in the tower, the controller sees that Flight 821 is climbing instead of descending. Aeroflot 821, according to my data, you are climbing. Can you confirm? Damn it. To resume the descent, the first officer adjusts the pitch of the plane. We can confirm and we're descending now. But now the controller sees Flight 821 flying past the approach path to the runway. He instructs the crew to loop around and try again. Aeroflot North 821, restart your final approach. Turn right heading 360, descend to 2,000 feet. But this instruction is ignored. A21, descend to 2,000 feet, turn right heading 360. Follow my instructions strictly. What the flight controller doesn't know is that the pilots have lost control of the plane. No way! Other direction! Flight 821 has crashed on the outskirts of Perm. Everyone on board has died. How did this landing turn into a fatal disaster? <laughs> 